Well, obviously, a big win um, for us. A lot of good, a lot of good things. Um, you know, just starting with Volquez. You know, this guy pitches to me total warrior today because what we didn't tell anyone is he threw his pin yesterday. So even though he was on regular rest, he had thrown a pin and and then still wanted to pitch today. So that. You know, and, and him getting out of some innings and keep battling it was huge. Uh, Harlan getting some huge outs there for us. The bullpen again, you know, did a great job. And then guys fought back. Tyler Moore gets a big hit for us. It sets up a run. Um, you know, Miggy was all over the place tonight. Uh, D was swinging the bat tonight. And then J, obviously JT at the end uh, was, was good to see. Can you talk about um, the D pressure he puts on defense and both those runs I think he forced a miss throw and then his speed at the infield playing in he's able to loop it over them talk about the effect he has on the game well he, obviously he can change a game and truly really, you know kind of what D brings to the table is that guy that brings a you know kind of a an excitement to our team I think is part of it part of our our group and when he's going well I think that puts so much more pressure on the defense to have to hold the ball on him as a pitcher, and then you're playing differently. So he definitely speed definitely changes the game. And the Mets bullpen was you know, 11 innings last night, and then finally come through tonight after a near miss there in the seventh. Uh, what did you see on that plate? The plate. Which one? Uh, the fourth inning. Oh, oh I, I, you know, Ed in, in the video feels he was 100 percent that he's safe, but. You know, I don't, I don't know. So, you know, we we thought he was safe, and um, but obviously there's some wording that says he's not. Um, so, but anyway, it didn't it doesn't matter. It, it didn't cost us anything, and um, you know we were able to get a you know JT just huge hit there at the end. Can we just talk about that? Is to finally break through. I think it was 13 straight scoreless from their pen, and you know just to kind of you know get them tonight. Well, it was just that game for both teams. I mean, I'm not quite sure what. I know their pin's been good, but our pin's been pretty good too. And uh, you know, I think it's, that, it's been that it's been a, it's been a good series. It was a good series in New York, uh, and now we we kind of go back and forth with these guys here. So I mean, they they got a good club. Uh, we feel like we got a good club. So hopefully, it it just continues uh, kind of falling our way instead of their way. But. Um, you know, we'll see. It's going to be a. It's going to be exciting. Kind of, you, if you if it goes ahead, was AJ going to go with second inning? Uh, was he going to go in the tenth? Do I have to tell you that? <laughs> well, you don't play. Either. No, we had doubled there. AJ was, you know, before the before the game felt like felt good and felt like he was one plus. So, yeah, AJ was going back out. I just talked about the pen tonight. That the kind of you know then uh, Delphi and well, you know you guys. Well, that's where we were at last night too. I mean, a few. Since you were late, Joe, uh, you know Harlan and pitch well. Uh, you know, got to get that first and third situation on that little button run they do, and um, you know, but he gets out of that. You know, two big outs. Uh, you know, for a kid just coming in today, that was huge. And then, and obviously, you know, Claw and, and Phelps and AJ. So it was, it was just good. To, you know, put that W on the board. Is, is Mickey giving you a good problem to have as far as what your thoughts on? Shorts up when Hedge eventually gets back in the way he's playing. Uh, you know, it's it's good to have good players, you know, and, and as many as you can get because as we see already, you know, a war of attrition at times. You're going to have guys get injured. You're going to need a whole group, and you're going to need to you're going to need to have 25 guys. So, it, Miggy is a good problem. Uh, we know what he's capable of. He's, he can defend all over the diamond, and, and his his offense has just gotten better and better. And again, I had him in LA where it was more of a defense, no hit, and the kids worked and worked and worked, and he's turned into, you know, a better offensive player. Tony, what Volquez gave it tonight? You know, he certainly battled and, <laughs> and came through. What, what did you see? Well, again, you're going to embarrass me because Volky's right back there. But uh, <laughs> you know, I talked about him, and you were late. Another, you were late again. Uh, <laughs> really, what Volky was able to do tonight, it was. You know he was he was a warrior tonight because what again what we didn't tell everyone was that he had threw a pin yesterday and he was he was a guy that said I'll take the ball 
you know, and I'm willing to do it. So he was huge for our club tonight. He gives us a chance to get our, our team back in order. Uh, you know, still obviously we had to use some guys down there, but we were able to not have to use everybody. So, uh, you know, again, he embarrassed me in front of Volke, tell him how good he is. And so <laughs> he seems to enjoy it. So we'll end it there.